Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Kabir Considers. In this video, I'm going to react to 12 most illegal dog breeds in action. Now this should be interesting because there's been quite a few stories recently here in the UK of certain dog breeds attacking people or children uh, and the, the breed of dog has actually been banned. So I've always wondered like why are certain breeds of dog banned? You know, what makes them uh, either dangerous or, or you know, unsavory or, or just, you know, what makes them like, why do, why are they not allowed to be owned? So this video here, cause I'm not really a dog person, but they still interest me. One day I might have a dog and like, it's just, I just want to educate myself on this topic. So yeah, I'm sure this is going to be really, really uh, interesting to watch. Let's do it. He's banned. Today, we're going to show you the capabilities of 12 wow, of the most dog is huge. powerful and illegal dog breeds in the world. But oh first, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell. Let Did it you bring see the one with the chains on its neck? In 2021. The Sarplaninac Shepherd is the perfect herding dog which can easily control a flock of sheep or even more stubborn pigs. But this dog can also protect you from a bear. The Sarplaninac's bravery has to it's do with its large massive. size. The breed averages 60 centimeters at the withers Goodness and on its me. hind legs is about as tall as an adult man. It's so but they big. can be bigger. Before you is a Sarplaninac that's 76 centimeters tall and weighs 90 kilos. Whoa! His leash is more for looks than anything because this man can be- 90 kgs? That's like my size. What the hell? Barely even keep a hold of this dog. Only a strong chain can hold the Sarplaninac. Don't hook it up to your bike though or you're in for a ride. No one is going to want to climb a fence and end up like this rag on the other side. If you're interested in owning a Sarplaninac now, then make sure you don't live in Denmark where these dogs are prohibited. Another dog banned in Denmark and restricted in Ukraine and Belarus is the Turkish Kangal. The Kangal has the strongest bite of any dog. Its bite force is 743 PSI, more than that of a lion. Wow. That's why this dog isn't even afraid to attack oh tigers. Gosh. Kangals are also very tall and can grow up to one meter at the withers. Here's what it looks like compared to a Labrador. Oh Such goodness. long legs allow the Kangal to accelerate to 50 kilometers an hour and easily jump up two meter fences. If the dog decides it wants to run, then keeping it on the leash is almost impossible. So, and you won't find them in Bermuda or the eight the states in the Corsa. United States where they're banned. Cane Corsos make ideal guards. And if you happen to be in their territory, you might have to hide on the roof of a car like this guy. But once the threat is out of the yard, the dog immediately stops pursuit. To keep this breed, you need a high fence because the Cane Corso is more than uh, 1.5 meters tall on its hind legs. But the most important thing about this dog is that it fearlessly attacks enemies larger than itself and rushes at wild animals. Then the Cane Corso uses its very powerful jaws, which in terms of bite. Like, look at the, the, the thickness of the hind legs, the muscle. You can tell that thing is powerful. Force are not much inferior to a Kangal's. The American Staffordshire Terrier has one of the best bite endurances in the dog world. An Amstaff can hang on a tire like this all day long. But the dog's most impressive skills are considered to be the high jump and the ability to climb 3.5 meters up a wall. Because of these abilities, the Amstaff is completely banned in Switzerland, Denmark, Portugal, Germany, Norway, Bermuda, and several cities in the United States. A lot States. of places. And to keep this breed in Ukraine, Russia, Singapore, Romania, or Spain, you need special permission. Look at how skillfully this dog runs. The Belgian Malnoir. This is like a, I think they use this in the police a lot, don't they? Or in the in the military. It's on a roof, stands on its front legs, and even walks along wires. Very smart Only dog. The Belgian Malinois, a favorite breed of many special forces, including yeah. the US Navy SEAL. These dogs are valued for their high trainability, but they can also use those teeth. Most importantly, the Belgian Malinois is the king of the air. It can oh. jump up to 7.5 meters. Look high. at that thing. Sorry, fly. Gordon, but you could only jump 1.2 meters. Some Belgian Malinois are so cool that they even parachute with the paratroopers. No way. But in order to own a Belgian <laughs> no Malinois way. in Ukraine, Romania, Malaysia, or Bermuda, you'll have to obtain a special permit. 
If you're planning on moving to Michigan or Wisconsin, then you'd better not have a Rhodesian Ridgeback, because you won't be allowed in with it. And in Ireland, Ukraine, and Bermuda, this breed requires special conditions for ownership. It's all because Rhodesian Ridgebacks are so bold that they'll pounce on a wild boar or even an adult lion. This Rhodesian Ridgeback wasn't even afraid of a whole herd of bulls. Rhodesian Ridgebacks love to run, and they have good endurance. At any time, the dog can take off and give chase at a speed of 48 kilometers per hour. Impressive. The most amazing thing is that they can even... That speed, considering the size of the thing, you know, it's, its legs, they're not that long compared to a human's legs, right? But they could just... 30 miles an hour is fast. That's probably faster than Usain Bolt. Even climb a tree to get to prey. This breed is only suitable for experienced owners because Rhodesian Ridgebacks may refuse to follow commands at any time. You'll never see a banned dog in Switzerland because these dogs are prohibited there. And in some cities, <laughs> the banned dog is a banned dog. <laughs> <laughs> in the USA, in Ireland, Germany, Romania, and Belarus, in order to get a band dog, you need to be examined by a psychiatrist. The fact is, a band dog can only have one owner all its life, one who must constantly prove their own dominance and leadership. The wow. band dog is also incredibly vengeful and will never forgive an insult, so training this aggressive dog must be left to professionals, and only from an early age. Otherwise, the dog's behavior is a case of Russian roulette, because the Band dog has the second strongest bite force of any dog, 730 PSI. So it is impossible to take anything from it until the dog loses interest on its own. The Alibi, Ooh, or Central Asian Avcharka, is one of the largest breeds on the planet. It's so By big. six months old, the dog is already 80 centimeters tall at the withers, and an adult Alibi can be up to two meters tall on its hind legs. Ooh. A one-year-old Alibi weighs Ooh. about 70 kilograms, but this Alibi name... It looks like a bear. It looks like literally a cross between a normal dog and a bear, like... The bulldozer weighed 125 kilograms. That's like a refrigerator full of food. The alibi is so strong that Are it you can pull a car me? weighing 1,150 kilograms. Here. So basically, you don't walk this dog, the this dog, dog walks, walks you. you. <laughs> Alibis have an innate fighting nature, because of which they aren't even afraid of fighting a tiger using their huge fangs. The alibi is restricted in Russia, Ukraine, Belarus, and Italy, and in Denmark, these dogs are outright banned. The Rottweiler has the, the second Rottweiler. highest number of attacks on people in the world. 10% of all attacks are by these 60... That name just sounds badass, doesn't it? Rottweiler. <laughs> Kilogram dogs. Or it's got a German, bear. right? That's nothing for a dog that plays with car tires as toys. Nevertheless, experts consider Rottweilers to be good working dogs, but only professionals can deal with them. This breed is banned in Bermuda, Ecuador, and some U.S. cities, including New York. And in many European countries, a special permit is required for Rottweilers. American Bulldogs are banned in Denmark, Malaysia, Bermuda, and several U.S. cities. It's all because of their explosive nature and desire to dominate a person. Even a sleeping American Bulldog can suddenly attack. And this dog does not open its jaws for anything, even if it's hit. It has a very low pain threshold and an innate instinct to fight to the death. American Bulldogs also have sharp fangs with which they can easily bite through sticks. American Bulldogs are some of the most powerful dogs on the planet. Watch this dog pull a cart weighing 4.5 tons. Get out. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. Hold on. Powerful dogs on the planet. Watch this dog pull a cart weighing 4.5 tons. That's 100 times its own weight. What is this girl thinking? Several I don't know. dozen countries have strict regulations on really... the Dogo Argentino breed. I can't believe in Norway, that. Denmark, Malaysia, and Bermuda, these dogs are completely banned. This dog is also designed for speed and endurance, as it runs at a speed of 40 kilometers an hour. It doesn't even lose speed when pulling someone on a snowboard or two. The Dogo Argentino has an enormous supply of energy which it must spend, otherwise it'll result in aggression.
The Pitbull Terrier is the leader in attacks on people in the world. In the pitbull United States terrier. alone, 34% of all dog attacks are by pit bulls. Oh of these, 66% were fatal. Pit bulls are extremely aggressive by nature. They attack cattle without any fear of getting kicked in the face. Their jaws are considered the strongest in the world given their size. Seriously, why do they hate bicycles so much? Pit bulls are also very strong dogs. Look at the muscularity. Look at the definition. Uh, this dog could probably win the Mr. Olympia. <laughs> with developed. Look at the back. What the heck? I need, I need its training routine, man. Can this dog give me its uh, its split? <laughs> when does it do its triceps? Muzzle, trucks, or even tractors. Because a pit bull is capable of climbing a nine meter Whoa. wall. The pit bull is completely banned in eight countries of the world, including Germany and Portugal. Strict regulations on keeping these dogs have been introduced in 53 countries, including 39 U.S. states. Let's end it there because it's time Unreal. for me to go feed my- That was insane. I still can't believe that the, um, I think it was the American Bulldog that could pull 4.5 tons. I need to see some more proof of that. Let me know guys, is that real or is that, was that embellished a little bit? Cause that just seems so unbelievable, doesn't it? Insane, like the, the, the dog itself probably weighs a max of a 100 pounds, 150 pounds, four tons. Incredible. I can see why a lot of these dogs would be banned because they are a real handful. If you're not an, a super experienced dog owner, like, yeah, I could see you just like losing control of that dog for sure. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one.